Update to the MSJ power supply problems. Sometimes it won't even turn on. Uh, it's plugged in. Everything is as it was, but uh, yeah, you go to flip it. Lights bump, nothing. Now what I'm told is that, uh, according to the manual, wait about 30 seconds. It'll uh, trip a little breaker in there, start itself back up. Uh, the question is, you know, why it's according to the manual. If it's detecting a load over 45 amps, it it will switch off like that. These lights here are not pulling nearly that much. 10 amps, maybe 12 at the most, when they're hooked together like this. So why is it not turning on? Uh, it'll bump a little bit. And they'll they'll just kind of bump and try to start to turn. It won't. I can hear a fan internally. It sounds like it's spinning up in there. I turn it off, it spins down, and uh, waiting the 30 seconds, sometimes it'll reset, sometimes it won't. Uh, basically, I've been since I've unboxed this thing, I've been going through the paces with it, turning it on, shutting it off, turning it back on, shutting it back off, and uh, not a very good thing. So, here we go. I'm going to turn it back on here. been probably about 30 seconds. And there it goes again. So... Just periodically, just root, you know, for some reason, every once in a while you go to turn it on, and it'll turn on sometimes, and other times it just decides, well, I don't want to turn on. And it'll trip that little, uh, the little breaker in there. you got to wait 30 seconds to a minute before it comes back on. I don't know what the deal is, but uh, I guess it's better than uh, overdriving everything. I'm going to keep messing with it. I'm not going to put any of my radios on it for a while. Just routine, you know, regularly just walk in here to the radio room every once in a while and just flip the power on and see if it comes on or not. But that's what it's been doing. Just saw it, tripped it on, nothing came on. Let it reset and it comes back on. So we'll keep watching it. Bye.